hi guys uh welcome back yeah so this is how uh, the video looks like without the transition first thing first uh go to, go here selective tool select all your clip right click on the clip any of the clip and go to switches then uh the last one disable resample always do this now go back to the normal editing tool this one uh now go to video effects and so look so i'm gonna do a transition here right here at the very beginning of the uh clip i'm going to add the uh, s blur mo curve so you're gonna need a sapphire plugin that's this one just drag the uh default one here now so what you want to do here go to uh where it says x and y uh at the bottom and change these settings to reflect bam and then uh name this save so uh we're gonna do zoom out here so go to a uh, z dist or z distance whatever and then click on this little clock have this one locked now i'm gonna put a uh, number here i might put like uh 0 0.4 yeah i'll just keep that number and then go about uh five frames forward so one two one two. okay this is five frame and put about uh nine go here uh, at the first keyframe right click make this one a fa fast fade change this shutter duration it's the uh the the blur you see i'll keep it about 0 0.8 let's see how this one looks okay it's not bad so go at the uh middle of the um clip so it's about here or here put one uh okay so let's see how this one looks looks okay let's add shade so go to dissolve shake we can find it where is it <laughs> here drag the default one and drag this like this make sure put this uh at first make sure this one is first and this one is second the shake is always first uh you don't have to change anything if you want to uh i'll show you in a new video another tutorial maybe let's uh change this to 0 0.250 let's see how this one looks okay that's a little bit too much but it's okay we're gonna animate this like this fast looks very good now the last one is the fish eye where's the fish eye scroll down and find where it says fish eye there you go fish eye drag the default one now we can see how this one looks like yeah don't worry we're gonna change this so make this make this zero uh and then put negative zero point uh you can put 30 i'll just put 30 or actually never mind 25 i'll put 25 and then animate this right here so this is our first uh, keyframe for the fish eye. We want this to end about in the middle. So make this zero. Perfect. 
again uh, right click on the keyframe and fast fade let's see how this one looks Uh, it looks good but uh the shake is i don't know I, thought, I think i don't like the shake okay so we're gonna do transition here at the end of the first clip right here so again same thing basically but this time we're not gonna add shake at the end if you want to add shake you can but uh i'm just not gonna add shake <laughs> so right here the zoom shake i mean the zoom i'm making so many mistakes <laughs> sorry guys so go at the end of the clip and then count about four or five frames one two three four five okay now add a keyframe and then add uh put this value about 0 0.9 or 900 now go at the end put about four drag this up all the way to the end make this one a slow and this one fast now let's see how this one looks Okay, so if you want to add a uh, fish eye, you can. So same thing. Uh, negative zero point twenty five. Make this one a uh, slow fade. This one fast. Okay, so the first clip is done. Let's uh, work with uh, the second one, the second clip. <laughs> so uh, first, first we're gonna do shake. I mean the uh, fish eye, then the uh, dissolve shake. Where is it? The default one, and one more. Uh, the asperma curve. Okay, so first dissolve, then the uh, S blur more curve, and then the last fish eye. Let's uh, animate this. Go about, I don't know, like seven frame maybe. Make this one fast. Then this one, uh, four maybe. go about five frames one two three four five no actually yeah this clip is uh, very short so we're gonna do four and then uh, in the middle the default I don't know what I'm saying <laughs> but just follow me guys so at the end this one oops okay so first fast you can leave these to uh, just like the way they are this one slow this one fast and the last one is fisheye so again uh, if you didn't save it just save it so we're gonna do 25 come here in the middle 0 at the end there we go so the first one first keyframe must be fast the last one must be uh, the middle one must be slow and the last one fast again
and then the shutter duration just change this to about uh, 0 0.8 yeah so uh that's pretty much it guys so let's see how this one looks <laughs> 